sit. Uh, show me your arms length. That's pretty good. But sit up straight. You can't be slouching. You don't want to slouch. Okay, now as I remember it, what was your five finger position um, from which your piece was created? Can you show me the names of the notes and tell me that what they are? E. I think it was. It was all whole steps, so it was major seconds. Right. Right. And it's nice. Put the pedal down and get the effect of what submerging those are. Right. Now, instead of kind of poking at the notes, can you glide over the notes so we get the sense of little ripples of water? Just float your finger. Yeah, but do it slowly. Like quarter notes. But float your fingers over quarter notes. Right. That's good. I like that. That's very good. Okay, now come back down and we're going to name the note. No, no, no. No, you're in the five finger position and come down from the highest to the lowest note, which would be B sharp, A sharp, G sharp, F sharp, E. Right, how come I change the letter names when I, when I name the notes? Because, because it's, a five, it's major seconds, right? And you have to follow the alphabet. Is that right, Chris? Okay, now this time I want you to name the notes as you're playing them, okay? Just up and down for me. steps. They have two names. They could be whole step notes or they could be major seconds, right? Now do the same thing in the octave lower in your left hand. Play over the five notes and name them. E, F sharp, A sharp. Oh, here, let's give a letter name. Try it again. G sharp. G sharp. A sharp, B sharp. B sharp, correct. Okay, and come back down. Yeah, yeah. But you want to frame this with a little bit of steady beat, okay? It doesn't mean the beat is like a robot. But float your fingers over like da. No, left hand. Show me left hand. Slowly. Yeah, pretty. You're pretty. Yeah, come back down. Right. Exactly. Good. Now take both your hands and go up and down. But float your fingers across. You're pretty. your thumbs and contrary motion. Not that fast, just keep your quarter note. We'll do that later. This week, we rehearsed your piece this week. You used your music, right? And last week, we actually um, we devised the piece and created the piece using um, those notes, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, can you play me the melody of your piece? And actually, we inserted a chord there too, right? Okay. I'm going to come over and, and refresh my memory of what your piece. Is. Yeah, yeah. We did different. We know all about double sharps now, though. Well, we'll figure, well, we'll figure out why we had to do that when we got there. Okay, so let me hear let, let me hear the melody. The first phrase is three measures. Is that right? I just want to hear the three measure melody. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's float it. Make it pretty. No, let's let's let this hand rest. We'll get, we'll do that in hand in a minute. Are okay, you ready? One. Two, let me give you a beat. One, two, three, four.
side is in four quarter time. So we're gonna roll what? In the, and fill up a measure of four, right? So one, two, three, four. Then what do we do next? Do we go an octave higher? Do we go an octave higher? Do we roll up higher? Octave, two octaves. Octave, two octaves. Okay, then let's do it. Here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so let's do it. Okay. I see. So so let's do it again and show me what exactly you did. Do it again. Yeah, from the beginning. And B sharp, B sharp, B sharp, B sharp, B sharp, B sharp, two, three, four, roll. Two, three, four. So this is the way your piece went, as far as I can see. You correct me if I'm not doing it right. So you have first this. Here's the tritone. Here's another tritone, three whole steps. Right? And then you rolled here, is that right? And then you rolled down here, correct? Mm -hmm. And then you came over and did retrograde inversion, which means you grab that B sharp. And now you're going opposite intervals as, as what you started, and then you introduced double sharps, right? Is that right? Now, where'd you do your roll? Right here? Roll down? Is that right? Yeah. Or you rolled down here? Yeah. Down and then you came back and ended rolling down? Is that right? Or going up? Yeah. Rolling down. Very nice. Okay, now let me get that in my mind. Refresh. I love this piece.